Welcome aboard guests. I will take the freighter captain first because you have a schedule. How may I address you? I am just a freighter pilot. I have two concerns. One is with my cargo. Mummies to be exact. They were not actual mummies, just androids. They were on our manifest. I will give you the contact information. Okay what is your other concern here? On the way here we spotted some kind of spatial anomaly. I pilot a freighter, I am not a scientist. We will give you the coordinates if you want to investigate. I need to leave. Lois get the coordinates and once we are done here we will investigate. I also want the mummies or androids, whatever, investigated. Send a team. I will have a team ready in a few hours. Hello Captain. My name is Canton Zoom. I run the Pyramid Research Center. As long as you are here I was going to suggest some collaboration with your science department. You could benefit my research, and we have fascinating data for you. Hello Candy, it's good to see you again. Hail Anubis. Thank you Director Zoom. I am Captain Sam Layton and this is the Columbia. We will be happy to work with you. Now Candy do you have something for me? I have some fascinating artifacts to discuss with your science team. They resemble Egyptian artifacts. I would like to use your science lab if that is okay. Please excuse me Captain. I need to go back to my center. Candy. I am sensing there is something else. Yes you are right. I saw the director talking to some, thing. Can you describe what you saw? It almost did not look real. He sounded like he was working for it. I mean Zoom. I will talk to the executive officer about looking into his operation. You two are to pose as a couple and investigate the pyramid center. You will put on civilian clothes. Keep your tree quarters handy but discreet. What exactly do you look for down there? Anything out of the ordinary, illegal or unusual. What do we do if we find something? You are to document as much as you can. Do not interfere. Then return to the ship. If you are found out, your cover story is that you are on shore leave. Good luck. Impressive. This guy has done a great job here. Yes, I could spend hours here. Let's move to a sheltered area. I am reading some kind of particle emitters but they are mostly shielded. We will need to go inside to get a better idea. Massive power generation recorded. Almost off the scale. This is not a part of the museum. I am not feeling too happy with what we are seeing. Let's get our data and get back to the ship while we still can. You are not going anywhere. You Starfleet types are so predictable. You thought I was not paying attention? I can detect a transporter signal. We are just on shore leave, that's all. Really. You are getting in over your head doing this. He can snap your neck any time he wants. My mummy will take you to a holding cell. Resist and you will die. Begin powering up the beams. We will bring the great god Anubis through the portal. All beams ready. Bringing capacity up to full. My lord. We are ready to bring you through the gate. You may proceed. Bring my eminence through the gate. Fire beams. Bring Anubis through. Even that starship will not be able to stop us. Captain I am reading multiple beams from the planet. They seem to converge at the reported location of the anomaly we were told about. Now hear this. General quarters, general quarters all hands man your battle stations. I need a team to go arrest Mr. Zoom.
Sir I am reading a wormhole forming. So far nothing is coming out of it. Have Zoom brought to the bridge as soon as he is here. An alien spacecraft has appeared on long range sensors. It is headed here. You are coming with us professor. We are taking you to the ship. You are making a serious mistake. The god Anubis will avenge me. Professor I think you need some time in an asylum. The god Anubis will punish you for what you have done today. I will shove a phaser in his face. Security to the Columbia area has been secured and the professor is in custody. Ready to beam up. Well professor, this time you are joining us as our prisoner. The god Anubis will protect and free me from you infidels. Really? Do you recognize this? It is my communication icon. It allows me to speak directly to Anubis. In reality, it is a holographic projector with an artificial intelligence interface. Watch. This is some kind of trick. I do not believe you. I am Anubis. You infidels will pay for this outrage. No, I don't think so. I don't take threats lightly. There is your god. It is a holographic projection. Oh and as for what you thought was coming through your gate, it is an alien spacecraft closing on an attack vector. We have lost power. There is a virus. It has shut us down. They have opened fire. Well Canton do you have anything to say? Help us turn off this virus. I have nothing to tell you. Then perhaps you would like to die with us? How long do you think this ship can last without main power? The mummies and this device were delivered by a company called the Starlog Company. They promised me a prominent position with Anubis. That's all I know. I swear. You should have known better. Engineering, restore full power. Disable that ship. Fire phasers. You tricked me. I recant everything I said. It's too late for that. Tell it to the judge. Throw him in the brig. It's funny how someone can be brilliant in some areas and stupid in others. That fits the professor. What was it all about? The mummies did not take any of my relics. Those represented pocket change compared to the plants. That's what they were collecting. We believe that the plants came from a planet called Talos 4, which is forbidden to all starships. They are a rare commodity and have resisted cultivation. Because they came from there, they are illegal. That raised their value in the eyes of collectors across the quadrant. Their plan was to steal the plants using the mummies, then come through the wormhole to collect them and return back through it. How did they get here to begin with? Some of the colonists told me that a funny-looking troll with big ears and sharp teeth sold them to the people here. Apparently the troll is immune to the telepathic abilities of the residents on the planet and took them from the surface. Doctor, what is Zoom's status? Is he fit to stand trial? I doubt it. He sounds really delusional. Who is going to replace him? You are looking at her. Meet the new director of this pyramid museum, Candy Mondo. Ironic isn't it? 
With all this technology we are no closer to learning who built the pyramids. Continue your other research as well. It looks like one more piece of a gigantic puzzle. And now to celebrate the grand reopening of the Pyramid Museum we will have a quick word from our new director Candy Mondo. We all know about the tragic events concerning former director Canton Zoom. I hope to redirect the museum's energies solely to study the mysteries surrounding the Egyptian and other pyramids. And now for the opening ceremony the Nebula Girls will take the stage. Everyone please welcome the Nebula Girls. <laughs> I thought we impounded that holographic projector. We did. Oh no I don't believe it either. I hope we won't be considered infidels this time. <laughs> 